Okay, so what I'm gonna do is um show you how to perfectly uh catch a bullfrog. And um what you really wanna do is um try to use your sound a lot before you just walk around the pond. And um you wanna try to uh know where your bullfrog is. Not only by sight, but also by sense. Because you could not even see that bullfrog, and all you're going to see is it just to leap into the water. So you kind of got to be sneaky. And I'm going to wait till I hear that um, dark mum, like that deep mumbling sound. And then I'm, I'm going to listen for where I hear it, and then that's where I'm going to go. Rocco seems to be getting kind of sleepy there. When you hear the um frog's deep um mumbling sound, sound like like mm, mm, um you'll understand uh like where it is, and that's a sign that they have popped out of the water. You kind of let, gotta let the frog get a little high in the water because when their bodies are in the water, it's gonna make us it a little more difficult for us to catch the frog. Our sound. Let's go. I, it wasn't. You couldn't really hear it that well, but I heard it. It's not that dark, so I'm not gonna use a light. But um, I'm just gonna try my best to use my eyes and my ears. And, and the thing is, if you miss the frog and it gets away, it's fine. You just gotta keep on trying, cause um. Catching frogs is actually something um, you can really practice, and eventually you just kind of fall into it and get the hang of catching the frogs. You kind of got to see the frog before it necessarily sees you. Sometimes, if you're lucky enough, the frog will be in the water, and it won't be moving because it is um, in shock. So that's the perfect time to just like pick it up with your bare hands. Because I swear, I, I think I saw a frog. Just went out of this rock. Oh, it's gone now. Let's continue listening our ears. I think the frog, somewhere around here, I think I heard it somewhere. I think I was coming from somewhere over here. It's kind of hard because I'm only holding my net with one hand, and it's a lot easier when I'm using two hands. But I gotta hold the camera. It's now been four minutes, so this is a bit of a long video, but it's 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 not like a, one of your average videos you'd probably see from me, so you know. I've been kind of doing this lately because it's beginning to get um, summer and I'm sorry I'm not making much videos because uh, I've kind of been outside a lot lately and I kind of every day I kind of have to walk around this pond and feed fish uh, so even if it might be a rock don't it, it's okay to be tricked by that because if you are tricked by that that means you are very desperate and you're very good, and you're very um, clever, like you're very cautious. And that's a good thing. Um, you gotta be cautious, 
because you never know there could be a frog just right ahead over here's where there's some where there's this huge frog always is over here um but he's uh, it's not very easy to sneak up on so let's be real quiet and sneak There he is, I think I see him. It's really dark. Crap, where is he? Sometimes you know he got away. I just heard something. It was over there. Well, let's continue moving forward. But at least we know that there's a frog nearby. If we hear that um, deep sound, um, that deep mumbling. Sometimes it's just one mumble. Crap little guy just jumped in. See, the thing is, I, I was too busy talking. I needed to focus what was in front of me. I'm gonna have to focus now. Yep, that's a frog. Gotta sneak. When you get a hold of the frog, you gotta be real gentle. Got him! Got him! I got him. What you gotta do is you gotta hold down the net. See him moving in the net? Okay, let's take this thing. Um, here, we're gonna... I'm gonna show you how you hold the frog. There, we got one. Perfect. Perfect frog. Got ourselves a frog. Excellent, nice big one too. Let's take this thing into the garage so we can look at it a little bit. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Put this thing in. Okay. Oh crap, that's a, holy crap, that's a big one. Okay, what you gotta do, is you gotta hold it by the leg. Look at those long legs. Look at that patterns on its belly. This is a nice frog, and that, sir, is how you, that is how you catch a frog. Uh, there, uh, that's amazing. Um, it's not, it's sometimes it's, could be easy catching frogs, but most of the time it's not very easy. But you just gotta try your best and just don't give up. Uh, that's all for today, guys. See ya.